Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and if you're new, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's video is going to be my 10 July favourites. So I have 10 different um, things here from beauty products to clothing. I'll start off with the first product which I'll go with beauty and then I'll go to like the clothing. So the first thing is Tea this. Treat Facial Cleanser with Aloe and it just looks like this. That light is like blinding it. I'm so sorry. Look at that. It just darkened my face because I like covered the light but you know who really cares. I'm pretty sure like yeah you saw it for a quick second. So yeah it's from Grace Cosmetics and I've been using this for ages though but it's still it's it'll always be one of my favorite things to use so it has it has actually helped me with my acne so much so when I get like a blemish or like a pimple or whatever I'll put it on the night before well I use it every night and um, it'll like go down or disappear this product is so amazing I'll do a video on the whole grace range um, the whole Grace cosmetic range because it actually has helped me a lot and a lot of people I'm not even joking I know a lot of people go on about products and how good they are and they don't really work but this is honestly amazing and a lot of people actually ask me where they get it where I get it from and things because they have seen um, how much it has changed my skin and made it look more healthier and more better so yeah I've been using this for like three years now and it has helped me so much and helped me gain so much more confidence um, with my face really so yeah that's the first product it's this Grace Cosmetics Tea Tree Face Cleanser with Aloe and also I'm pretty sure they're like all yeah they're all natural contains natural antiseptic properties and is suitable for all skin types especially acne prone and oily skin gently cleanses and purifies while maintaining the skin's correct moisture balance and also improves um, overall skin condition yeah this is amazing I highly recommend um, if you have yeah acne prone skin to get this because it lasts forever and it works you will see results in a week the next product is this blemish mud face mask um, this is what it looks like well, I'm just gonna show over here um, so I use this um, once a week and it actually makes my skin so soft and it just I don't know how to explain it as soon as I wash it off my skin is so soft I can't I can't even explain how soft it feels like I love using this I'd use it every day but I don't think that's good um, so yeah it helps um, with my blem my blemishes as well and my acne so this one is a good one as well so it our special mud blend of aloe vera, willow, rosemary and witch hazel naturally target your problem areas for a clean complexion. Another great product that I have loved in July. The third product are these, they're actually from Coles. Um, they're these Coles 3 in 1 sensitive facial cleansing wipes sensitive skin and fragrance spray so this is what they look like so i've gotten so many fragrance free wipes and like for sensitive skin and actual still burn my skin in some areas but this um particular product is actual so amazing it also gets my mascara off my waterproof mascara which i've used so many as well and it it doesn't get my mascara off believe it or not but these are so cheap I'm pretty sure they're like three maybe I'm pretty sure that's three dollars they have 30 wipes in them and um, they have it's enriched with aloe vera and cucumber extract removes stubborn makeup including waterproof mascara I've seen so many packet um, wipes that say they remove mascara and so many fail at that but these are amazing I highly recommend these as well so I'm gonna go on to my fragrances now I have two um, so the first one is this white mask um, from the body shop it's actually empty at the moment I need to get more because that's how much I use it because I love it um, my nan used to wear this ages and ages ago um, and 
I smelt it one day. I think my mum was wearing it and I asked her where she got it from and then she got it for me for my birthday and then ever since then I get it. I top it up every birthday and Christmas. So I don't, I can't really explain the smell. It's different, like, I'm not even going to explain it because I'm going to use the wrong words and embarrass myself. But yeah, it just smells really good and it's from the body shop and I usually get it in a pack with um, soap even though I can't use the soap because I have really sensitive skin but yes, I really love this perfume. So the next product is this Katy Perry Royal Revolution perfume and this is what the box looks like as well. I keep all my perfume boxes. And yeah, this is what it looks like. So it looks like a diamond shape and then it's like got this really cool lid. Um, I'm not sure what that is on the lid. Maybe cats. Goodness knows. But yeah, this is another one. I wear this every day. Um, I'm not even going to explain the smell of that either. I'm so bad at explaining things. I'm so sorry. But yeah, so this one is really good. It's really amazing. It's one of my favourite perfumes ever. And I think um, I actually found this in a sample um, from one of my show bags like two years ago. And then I only just got it. But yeah, this is my other favourite perfume. Now I'm going to move on to makeup. So first I have this... Max Factor Excess Volume Extreme Impact um, Mascara. So one side is an extreme volume and the other one is a dark look you And this is what it looks like. So um, these are the pots, like what they have, like the product is in. And the middle bit is the one, so both of them. So this is what this one looks like. I'll show you what the other one looks like too. I should have showed you before. So this one's more fine and um, spread apart the the brush, and this one is more like you can tell that that's you can tell that that one's full of volume. So I got this mascara in July, and um, I've been using it ever since. It's just really amazing. It makes my eyelashes like. I don't have um, fake lashes on. I barely ever wear, wear fake lashes because I don't know how to put them on. That's um, quite embarrassing for me too because I really love makeup but I can't put on lashes. Um, but yeah, I use this every day and it makes my eyelashes look very bold and they don't like clunk together. Like I hate it when I put on mascara and they just all stick together. You can separate your lashes by using the smaller wand and... Um, I just think that this product is really amazing and I haven't found a really good mascara since um, the the Balm mascara. I don't really, I forgot what it's called, the Balm mascara, but yeah, it's, I have two favourite mascaras, but I haven't been able to find the Balm mascara in ages, so goodness knows I'll ever be able to find it. So my next makeup product is this Chi Chi brow pomade and it just looks like this. A lot of people, I have seen a lot of people use this actually. Um, it's just really, the texture is really nice. Um, it's not even hard, it's like creamy. I've used mine, like it's nearly gone. But yeah, that's what it looks like. Um, it's like a glass little pot, but like I'm wearing it now. Oh, damn, I forgot about these. I'm wearing, yeah, it's in my eyebrows now. And I think that they look so much better than um, the pencil. Like I've, I've used pencils and other brow pomades like um, the Ardell pomade and stuff like that and I just think that nothing that I found compares to this which a lot of people um, have said it's even better than Anastasia or Beverly Hills but I've never used it so I can't really say anything about that so yeah this is my favourite brow pomade ever right now the last um, makeup product is this original RCMA makeup no color powder so the rcma sounds stands for research council of makeup artists no the research council of makeup artists I, i'm pretty sure that's what rcma stands for it's just missing the little letters if not i'm sorry because i'm pretty sure that's what it stands for so this is what it looks like and it's just like this white powder i think i got this off of 
Beauty Bay. Yeah, I got my friend to order off Beauty Bay for me because I have no idea how to use my card. Oh no, I didn't have my card yet then. That's why I couldn't buy anything offline. But yeah, so she ordered it for me. Um, back when I first started a YouTube channel, I actually started a different one with her. And then I ended up... I don't know why we stopped it. I think we both like didn't like the videos and we felt uncomfortable that they were the funniest videos ever but yes this powder I used to bake my face I used it today under my eyes and down my nose and on my forehead I just think it's um, like it's a really good powder it doesn't have flashback either that's what I really love about it and it's just such a fine like it's so fine it's so soft and it doesn't make your skin look too dry when you put it on under your eyes like I don't I can't you guys need to use it to see it. Like, I honestly think it's one of the best products out that I've used for baking. Now moving on to clothes. I only have two things to show you. I only have two things to show you. Um, which the first one is this beanie. It's actually from Kmart. It was $9 and me and my friend um, got them because one of my other friends from school, Candice, she'll probably watch this video and see beanie she got one but a darker pink and then me and my other friend Chloe went to the shop and she decided let's get matching beanies yes I know we got matching beanies and we got this one and they were nine dollars or seven dollars um, maybe they were seven dollars I think they were seven dollars but yeah we they're really soft and they're like a velvety and they have like a velvety look to it I don't know if you can tell but it's so soft it keeps my hair so warm I I actually wear this to school even though my school colours are blue. Um, I still wear this to school because it's really soft and it keeps me warm. And when it rains it keeps my hair um, dry as well. So this beanie is the softest beanie I've ever had. And lucky last are these white high waisted um, denim jeans. So look how like high waisted they are. They are really high waisted. Um, they're from Supre and they are stretchy. They are a stretchy material, but they haven't stretched on me. Like I've put them in a washing machine like t 10 times probably already and they're still like nice. They still fit nice on me. Um, yeah, not stretched at all. And they're just really comfy. They're the comfiest jeans I've ever worn. When I go out, I wear these. Um, put on a nice pair of heels and... Um, nice shirt with these jeans and I don't yeah they're just the, I reckon they're the most comfortable jeans I've ever worn so yeah they're from Supre and I'm pretty sure they I don't know if they're there anymore because I haven't seen them but these jeans are called seriously good jeans and you know what I agree with them go get yourself a pair if they're still in so that concludes this video for today give this video a thumbs up if you liked it um please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i hope you guys really enjoyed this video today um and i'll see you guys in my next video